Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Heather. Um, as you guys see, I'm walking, but oh so slowly. Um, quick summary. I fractured my arch because it was compensating for the right. My Achilles heel is completely torn, and my knee has no cartilage and some tears. So I definitely need surgery. Um, my dentist, I was supposed to have appointments today at 4 to pick up my permanents because when I was sick, I couldn't make it. Um, and they're like, we have a cancellation for 12. And I was like, crap, I gotta hurry up. So I'm heading over there now, which I will be way early uh, for, but I did that because I can barely walk. So it is what it is. But today is permanent denture day. I am a little worried, but I'll tell you in a minute. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, hi, what's up? I've been here for about three years. I'm the one that gives you the factual information, the truth behind things. What some people sugarcoat, I'm not Willy Wonka, I don't sugarcoat shit. Um, I just want people to know the truth when getting into this and to prepare themselves. I didn't have any of that. I was naive and blind to the whole situation and I learned everything the hard way. And if I can make anybody's lives a little bit easier, I will do so. Um, so yeah, that's why I talk about products, I talk about the truth about products, what you wanna look for, what you don't, how to do things. I do the how-tos, the factual information, people want me to look up stuff, I do for that. It's a whole bunch of stuff. But if you like my content, guys, don't forget to hit subscribe. Um, and make sure you hit that bell button and click all, or you're gonna miss out. Um, since today is Halloween, oh yeah, I didn't mention that. I'm gonna probably drop this video the day I'm doing this video. Um, so I have my momster shirt on. I did Stevie's makeup at like six in the morning for school. But Thomas said he had gym, so he wasn't gonna do that. But moving along, I'm getting my permanent one today. And I'm a little worried. Um, because when I first went there, it was, we'll just say way big. And here's the weird thing. He told me that it was gonna be an underbite, which I don't, I have an overbite. And so that was a little weird. But when he put the denture in, he knew that it was gonna be way too big. Maybe they should have did impressions a little bit better. Or the people that it sends out to, them actually follow through with it. Because I know my dentist is so precise, pushes down, gets in every little nook and cranny, so I know it wasn't his doing. But, When I had it and put it in my mouth back in September, or what month are we in? Uh, maybe August when I did it. Um, it was way high in the back, so I think I'm gonna have to do my own adjustments. I prefer to do my own because most of the time, all dentists seem to do the inside of the denture, which they're big enough, bro. You don't need to do the inside. It's the denture wall that needs to be adjusted at any time, no matter what it is. It's 90% 90, 90 of the time always gonna be the denture wall that needs to be adjusted. Because the inside our gums shrink, even if it's been a little bit over a year now since I've had my immediates for my bottoms. Sorry guys, switching out the hands because they freaking hurt. But am I worried my bottom denture is gonna be a shit show? Yes. I wish I could film in there, but he doesn't allow any of that. He doesn't do electronic crap at all. He's very old school very but god damn my ankle's killing me Whew. but I will let you guys know how it is afterwards if I bring it home um, I'll just fix whatever needs to be fixed of course I'm gonna put denture fit in it I do that no matter what denture I get I put denture fit in it one I don't do hard acrylic feeling at all um, and two it's just far more comfortable and then I don't need adhesive even with my bottom immediates, never needed adhesive. Because I just put denture fit in it. So, denture fit's been a godsend. I even think about it often. Like, if denture fit didn't exist, I know I'd be using adhesive a lot. And I know I'd be stuck or reline it, which sucks. It's a lot. So, I am very grateful and blessed for denture fit's existence. You have no idea. And there's still a lot of people that are like hesitant to try it, which I get it. But when they do try it, they always message me and say, dude, this is freaking amazing. And I'm like, right? It's, first of all, I'd, I'd use it just for the comfort alone. 
but the fact that it doesn't it doesn't like I would say suction for the bottom because the top suctions because of the pallet but I would say it works with saliva to maybe tighten it a little bit good god and go from there so I'm gonna stop filming because people are going crazy because I'm filming and I'll let you guys know how it goes god I hope they come out good it's I think it's everybody's worry when they first get their dentures and I don't care if you're a veteran or not, you still worry. You will always worry, crap, is it gonna come out good? Is it gonna be too big? Is it gonna be too loose? Is it gonna be uneven? There's a lot of things you worry, and I still worry about that, even doing this for three years, guys. Uh, the same, you don't understand, just because I've been doing this for three years on my top, one year from my bottom, I still have the same problems, the same issues, the same worries as you do. It's no different. But I'll check you guys on the way back coming home to let you know how it is. Okay, you guys, I'm back and I'm all happiness. But that's my dental office, Advanced Family Dentistry. So if you're in Oneonta, New York, tell them that Heather, he should know who I am, but Heather, um, Denture Diva on YouTube, that you do her teeth, sent me to go to you. If so, if you're in my area, region, go to him. He accepts Medicaid, he does all of that. He does a beautiful job. So you know how I told you guys when I did my wax try on, I was nervous because it was super loose. And I mean, they knew before it was even gonna go in my mouth. They warned me the second I sat down. He was worried this time it was gonna be too tight. He put it in, it's like freaking gorgeous. Like perfect. And I even said that to him, like, dude, I have no complaints. They are the most perfect set of bottom dentures that I've ever had. I thought it was gonna be hard for me to give up my bottoms because they're perfect. They really are. I mean, they're loose, but they're perfect. Because, you know, I do my own. I didn't even need to do an adjustment with these. The second he rinsed them off, he put them in my mouth. And he goes, it might be too tight. I'm like, no such thing. And he put it in my mouth. And I was like, oh, my God, this is awesome. I'm like, it's only a smidge loose on the back, which is fine. Because I'm going to do a soft reliner anyway. Because I don't like hard acrylic. And I use DentraFit. And um, I explained to him again what DentraFit is. And I was like, yes, yeah, the soft silicone reliner is so comfortable. So, yeah, totally amazing. Amazing. I was so excited, but hold on one second, guys. Okay, so I wanted to do a giveaway. Yay! So, happy Halloween to everybody. Um, I'm going to try to go live today especially, but as soon as when I can, I'm going to upload this video as I'm walking and talking. And I'll go live and I'll show you guys my actual permanent denture, how it looks. But for the soft reliner I put in it, he did an incredible job. Like, it's freaking amazing. It's actually... Like, they always do a great job. They always did. But I was worried because of the last looseness that it was still going to be loose or high. No, they fixed every little bit of it. And it ended up being tight. And yes, everybody knows it's hard to get a tight denture. My top was always tight. I always psh, love my tops. But my bottoms, I was worried. Because, you know, for seven years of me having them, you want them to start off tight. Because, of course, you're going to have gum shrinkage even through the years. Just not as fast as the first year. So, once you put it in my mouth, oh, so excited. Okay, so anyway, I'm gonna do a giveaway. So make sure you guys watch this video. If you didn't watch this video fully through, go back and start all over again. Because YouTube does tell me how much you guys watch individually. And that's how I know who actually can truly enter my giveaways. I write down names. It's tedious, guys, and it's annoying. But I wanna give it to people who follow directions. So please follow directions and watch this video that's not long from start to finish. Um, and then you can start to enter. Now here's what you have to do. First one, watch the video, entire video from start to finish. That's the first thing you have to do. Two, make sure you're subscribed to my channel because I will not, I only do it for my subscribers only. That's just how I am. I give back to my subscribers. They watch my videos and show me love. I'm gonna show them love by giving stuff back to them. So it's a mutual love here we got going. Also make sure your bell is on and hit all so you don't miss out. That's actually for you, not for me. Um, so, I'm trying to make sure I get it all and you guys have it all. So one, make sure you watch the video fully through. 100% start to finish. Two, you have to be a subscriber. Three, you have to email me. Put Halloween giveaway. I'll probably do more, but this is just for the video. So email me, which will be in the description of the video. The hour next to the title of this video is my email. My email is also BYR. 
NES1223 at gmail.com. You can rewind and hear that again. Um, and like I said in the subject, put Halloween giveaway. And you want to put inside the main body your full name and full address, how you would put it on an envelope. And then you can write whatever you want to me. This is going to end today's Monday. I'll end it Thursday. So Thursday at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time, this will end. So you have from now until 11, or, uh, 11 Jesus, Thursday at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time. Got to get my speech together, guys. So this giveaway will be goodies that I'm going to give you. I'm also going to do a live. I'll do a couple of things to give away. But it's to give you guys treats for Halloween. And it's products that I will highly, always highly recommend use myself. I'm not sponsored. I do not get money off of YouTube at all. Wish I did. Um, and I do want to thank everybody because I'm almost out of the 8,000 subscribers. And for two and a half years, 8,000 subscribers is pretty freaking awesome. Especially when I did YouTube. It was in six months I got 1,000 subscribers. So that was actually pretty cool. But I do thank you guys so very much. That's why I always give back to you guys as much as I possibly can. Um, even being on SSDI, I'm limited as well. But if I have extra stuff, I want to give it to you guys. Because I know what it's like to live in a denture world and you need the right products to benefit you and your health. Because it's not just benefiting a piece of plastic. It's benefiting your life, what's best for you, and not to poison yourself. Um, so... I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this giveaway. I don't know how many people I'm going to pick out of this video. It might be one. It might be three. I don't know. But definitely get on this giveaway. Guys, like I said, it ends Thursday, 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time. I was very repeatingly telling you guys what to do for this giveaway. So, so many people will not follow it. But also, too, when you're done with everything, so I know that I don't miss anybody, in the comment section of this video, type done when you're done doing everything I told you to do because then I look up your name and then I make sure you did it all and then I add you into the list of people who go into the giveaway um yeah so I hope you guys have a happy Halloween I love you guys stay safe stay healthy and have a healthy happy day today later guys